Hi guys, I hope you're well and welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna show you today how to do this hair look. So if like me, you've got straight hair, this will be perfect for you. If you're lucky and your hair holds a wave, again, this will be great for you as well. And I'm just gonna show you some products that I use, the curler that I use, the method that I use and things like that to kind of get this really nice, natural, kind of bohemian wave look. To wash my hair, I use this L'Oreal Extraordinary Clay Shampoo and Conditioner. I just think it makes my hair feel really soft um, without making it too kind of fly away and too silky. So first up is the most important product of your hair care routine and this is Heat Protect Spray. At the moment I'm using this Dove Styling Care Heat Protect Spray but of course any heat protectant will do the job. And then the next product is really good if like me you use conditioner on your hair and it goes really soft and fly away. Um, this product is by Davines and this is the Blow Dry Primer. It just makes it really easy to style once I've dried my hair. And then I'm gonna start drying my hair. Because my hair is naturally straight, I actually just really rough dry my hair, but I do always flip my head over and dry my hair upside down to begin with. This gives it loads of body and volume. So for this look, I am using a barrel tong, and this is basically where you wrap the hair around the hot part of the tong. I find that this sort of tong gives your hair a really nice kind of relaxed wave, almost like a beachy wave, which is perfect for this look. This one I've got here is by HSI, and it has interchangeable ends, but of course there's so many on the market right now. I'll leave some of my favorite brands below with links to the tongs that would create exactly the same look. So as you can see, I'm just wrapping the hair round, and when you get to the back section, don't worry, it's not as hard as you think. What I like to do is actually take the back sections and pull them round to the front and curl them that way. I then like to go back through my hair and take some smaller sections and give those a curl as well. Again, because my hair is quite straight, the curls do drop quite a lot, so I find the tighter I can get the curl in the beginning, the longer they'll last throughout the day. And then if my hair is lacking a bit of volume at the roots, I spray through some dry shampoo. I actually really use dry shampoo for volume and thickness, which is also a really good point of dry shampoo. Once I've sprayed that through the roots, I then grab some hairspray, and I've got my holy grail of hairspray here. This is by Got To Be, and this is the Glued Blasting Freeze Spray. This spray will keep your curls put all day long. Take it from me, it works. There you go guys, that is the finished hair look and I hope you enjoyed this video. As always, if you do try this at home and you upload a photo to your social media, please, please, please make sure you hashtag Tiny Twist Tutorials because I love to see how you guys do these hair looks, what they look like on you and I think it's actually quite fun to go through them all. So make sure you hashtag me on that. If you're not already, make sure you subscribe. The button is on the screen right now or you can find it down below as well. Um, I'm on all social media channels all day, every day, chatting to you guys and my name on everything is Tiny Twist. So it'd be nice to see you along there. And I will see you again, as always, very soon for another video. Any recommendations on what you want to see, hair related, beauty related, absolutely anything, leave in the comments below and I'll add them to my list. Thank you guys and I'll see you soon. Bye. Mwah. Ugh, now I've got lip gloss on my hand. Sticky. <laughs>